Bret Hart and Shawn Michaels were polar opposites. From the beginning, the groundwork was laid for a fierce rivalry. I just want to say one thing, Shawn Michaels, I can promise you for 60 minutes, you were in for the absolute worst pounding of your entire life. The historic Iron Man match did nothing to settle their issues. In fact, it only fueled the fire. Just because I choose to live my life openly and freely does not make you a better man. As the taunting unfolded, their bitter feelings intensified. You're nothing but a degenerate. You're the most arrogant, pompous guy I've ever seen. I thought I could do it. You're way out to me, pal. You'd like to hit me, but you, you don't have the insights to do it. And this here is what it's all about. And until you have this, you will never, ever, ever be the showstopper. Red Hart, you are a zero, my hero. I'm gonna kick your little scrawny ass. A story full of twists and turns saw Bret Hart's contract negotiations become the focal point of what would become their final encounter. Everybody just keeps turning a blind eye. You keep turning a blind eye. Everybody in that dressing room knows that I'm the best there is, the best there was, and the best there ever will be. I don't think there's ever been a rivalry that has been talked about as much worldwide as this issue between Bret Hart and Shawn Michaels. And the smart money is, is that you will never, ever see it again. doesn't want to do business, then we need to do business for it. Oh boy, it's gonna be a tough one. So went by pitfall, hidden objective, so they're not gonna tell me shit. Okay. Oh my god, my camera. My camera. Garbage. Two of the most dominant. Two of the most premier athletes messed up. in the history apologize. of the WWE are moments away from locking up right here in Montreal. Ah, oh, this is what it's all about. How many times have we heard Shawn Michaels say he won't lay down for anybody? And how many times have we heard Bret Hart say he's the best there is, the best there was, and the best there ever will be? Well, it's time to put up or shut up. One of them will put up, and the other will be shut up. This is very personal. This match is going to be stiff. It's, it's going to be physical. The series. competition couldn't be any keener than it is right now.
do this. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, that this is the last time that these two superstars will ever meet in the ring. Missed him in another blind miss him. What a nasty elbow! Can you believe the hype Come Sean on. got off that elbow drop? There we go. Oh man, what a neck breaker! I think we all know how I have to win. <laughs> Too late. Yeah. Hey, it's Vince McMahon. What's the owner of the WWE doing out here? Well, how should I know? Is this company, though? I'm sure he just wants to see that this match doesn't end through disqualification. The two lock up. Shocking for position. I got it. 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 Yeah. 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 What ah. For the neck break. Suck it. They slip flying forearm. And there's the flying forearm by the showstopper. Ow, oh, what an elbow. What a kick that was. And Bret Hart gets sent to the floor. Oh my gosh. Shawn Michaels, the main event, certainly has the means to back up his confident attitude. There we go. Ouch. Oh. A destructive spinning neck breaker. I don't like the way that hits shot. Levels is pulling out every stop to heads up. And that's why they call it high risk, folks. Did I miss it? Something else. Oh, it's the same move. Michaels is unusually methodical at this point in the match. He is the European champion. And by the way, the European championship is not at stake. Yeah, you're right. This one is about the WWE championship. And quite possibly about the future of Bret Hart. Shawn Michaels is getting fired up. A blind four. Sending the opponent crashing down to the ground. He lights up his chest with that chop. Look at him unloading with the Dez press. Sean's going to the top. Oh, look out, down. There he goes again. Figure four. Wait, um. Collar and elbow tie up. No, no, no. Ow, ow, ow. A suplex like that takes a lot of power and delivers a lot of impact. He's left the ring. This could get interesting. Look at this. I love it. Michaels is a performer. Wait. So just wait, but I can hold on until you the H. Wait, how do I apply a sharp shooter? Right? Grapple? No. Breaking point submissions. Alright, I just have to. I think I have to just get him on his back. And he's out of the ring. Really? Again. 
showing some disrespect here. No one can move as quick or with as much agility without vintage heartbreak kid, the hitman. How do I let them? Oh, Seems to have lost control of this match. Don't count him out just yet. If he locks in one of those submission holes, this match could just about be over. Get him. Now that's just rude. He's got it locked in. Will this be it? What a neck breaker. Here's a cover. Going to work on the net now. Oh, the arrogance. How do I flip them? There has to be a... Dragging. L2 and R2 drags and change target breaking point. Oh, opponent reposition. Use R to reposition the opponent in the following situations. Um. Oh, okay, so. That's not his signature move. How do I perf He has then when Brett is on his back and I use it to apply the sharpshooter, yeah. Do I have to do it with the, I think I have to do it with a signature. There we go. Right in the kisser. Oh okay, I have to do a signature first. So I have to build it up. Okay. No problem. Devastating. Just a devastating net break. And another kick. Neck breaker. That was vicious. Brett's in trouble. Oh, what a beautiful textbook suplex. Ah, not even close. What? I was so there. Space chicken wing. Hold it up, end over end. Oh, he's gotta be in pure agony. The German released. Super 
suplex. Look out! Look out! An impressive suplex. Okay, maybe if I do a finisher. What? what yes, there we go. Michael is going to try and beat Bret Hart with a sharpshooter. Yes, he is. Are you kidding me? Ring the bell! Ring the bell! 